Ignore me, I am a stairs. Ignore me, I am a stairs. Hello, Internet, welcome back to more Qbert. In the last episode of Qbert, we were stairs. And in this episode of Qbert, we're going to be stairs. Also, we're playing Pokemon Coliseum. I don't know if you noticed that. Uh, we were in the Pirate Cave in the last episode. And in this episode, we're going to get further in the Pirate Cave. And uh, we never fought this guy. Duking Finish, this is a dawning of mere bees time. You're like seven. Why do you know about the politics of your city? I certainly did when I was seven. <laughs> I don't even know now. You think I care? No, no, I won't play my vi my Vinci games. I am what is wrong with the generation. The very embodiment of it. And proud of it. Wait a minute. Why do so many people have low tads? Low tads and their evolution lombre. It's so weird. It's uh, low tad is low tad is okay. Oh, many times got uh, super song. I don't know if he had that in the last episode or not. It's been a while since I recorded that. Uh, uh, I mean they're they're decent enough Pokemon, but not decent enough to have like six or four of them. That'd just be dumb to have four low tad evolutions. Like, come on, really? Who would do that? I'm in hyper mode. Yeah, you feel so red. Mad time, that's not a good thing. I'm so hyper. Can we get Cheetos on the way home? Cheetos and ice cream, they're my favorite when they're put together. But Mad time, you can't you can't put those two things together. It counterbalances the deliciousness of both of them. It makes it bad. No, that's not how it works. I it's good. Can we guess some master? Yes, Mad time, it will make you quiet down. Then we will get Cheetos and ice cream. Oh, you don't gotta be so mean about it. I'm sorry, Mantine. Just you're trying on my nerves sometimes. You know that. I'm sorry, Master. You want to hug? No, you're a giant manta ray. It'll hurt me. Oh, we won. Yay! We beat Evat. What have you done to my Pokemon? Well, be I've beat them in a battle. That's. Kind of what I've been doing to everyone, really. Gurmir B's age is really going to. Oh, I thought his age was going to show or something. Uh, I'm going to go back to the PC, actually, because I want to do some rearranging my. Oh my god. Do some rearranging of my team, because I thought about it between episodes, and there's some changes I want to make. Alright, I rearranged my team just a little bit. Instead of having Skip Loom, I decided to drop Skip Loom off and get Metatite, because Metatite will just be more helpful if we need to send him out in a battle more than Skip Loom, because it's freaking Skip Loom. Who cares about Skip Loom? Um, also, I took the Twisted Spoon off Metatite and gave it to Espeon, because Espeon can use it more than Metatite can. I was trying to figure out a way that I could put Bayleaf on team. But there's some battle there's some battles coming up and I want I want Slugma to be Yes I got rid of her Oh she's gonna be on the stairs. Um there's some battles coming up that I want Slugma for well I don't want him but yeah I want him, I like Slugma, okay, he's my bud. Um and Furret. I wanna keep Furret and Slugma with me, but there's some battles up ahead that I'm also gonna need Did I go this way? I don't remember going this way. Well, did I did I go this way? I don't think I did. Maybe I did. Oh god, I'm lost. Oh dear. I'm not confused anymore. Okay, anyways, there wasn't really room, and I need Noctowl for a fight coming up, but there weren't. There wasn't really room for Bayleaf. I wanted to make room for Bayleaf, have Bayleaf on my team, but it just wasn't working out. Oh, how poor Zayla, who who even cares about Zayla? He's a sinking Zayla. Zayla is the worst person I've ever met in the universe. This isn't the way to go. Oh, crap. Oh, I am all confused and confused in all kinds of different ways. But I think I think I'm on the right track. There's one more place you need to go. Gotcha. Right on it. Like the planet and Earthbound, which I've never played, but I want to. But I need a Wii U. D balls. Going down the stairs. Went down the stairs. Went down the stairs and going up here. And maybe there's some fun stuff up here. Are you looking for Dookie's Pokemon? Could it be beyond here? I wonder. I hope so. Because if it's not, I'm going to lay down and cry, Mila. And you'll have to watch. It'll be embarrassing and a little awkward for you because you'll be seeing a grown man cry. You'll be like, uh, can I get you something? No, just leave me be. <laughs> I'm useless anyways. <laughs> Hi, master. Oh, man, I know it cheers me up. Power of the twisted spoon, baby. Boom! Oh. I hate... I'm never going to comment on how powerful a move is going to be ever again. Because every time I do, the game's like, NOPE! Aww. I kind of feel bad. I made the, the bear sleepy. Bears are simultaneously the most adorable and the most terrifying animals on the stinking planet. I love bears. 
Where's that Pokemon? I'll never tell you. Her voice changed a lot. And I'm seeing her cry now. And you know, I feel this interview less embarrassed. Don't you people have any sense of direction? I bet you're forgetting around this. Yes, actually, you would be surprised the amount of having trouble with this cave. Purple chick, I'm just going to slip past you. I did not think that that would work. Oh, there's nothing up here. Well, then what's up? What are you doing here? Oh, well, what? What is that nonsense? She doesn't bother you even talk to you. Like, she sees you walk past. She's like, that is not my job. But you come up to her, she's like, <sighs> she, like, throws down her newspaper and is just like, fine. I'm like, no, we don't have to. I was going to ask you on, like, a date because you're a sexy purple chick. And she's like, no, no, come on, let's do this. And I'm like, oh, why do, why do all my dates go like this? <gasps> bubble beam! Bubble, bubble, bubble beam! Bubble, bubble, bubble beam! That's the bubble beam song. If you have bubble beam, then Espeon uses helping hand. So you can take out that lily. Even though it's a rock, it's a rock grass type, so maybe that wasn't good. And Mantine has better special attack than it does physical attack, even though neither are from that great. So bubble beam should do a significant more amount of damage. Never mind. God, I wish I had water absorb. Man, Sai, why do you have to have swift swim? Because I like to swim in the rain, master. But it would be better if you were absorbing the rain into your body, and not just the rain, every type of stinking water that came at you and used it for food. No, I like it more like this. Wee! I go really super fast in the rain. That doesn't even make sense, Man, Tine. It doesn't have to. I'm Man, Tine. Y you got me there. It was no flick that you managed to come out here. Well, uh, uh, gross, but I just want to go on a nice date with you. Could you please hear me out? We can go to the zoo. Or maybe the museum. I want to waste everything. There's nothing here for you. Why are you all busy wasting that time? Oh, this was not the right path. Don't worry, I knew that. I actually did know that one. I just want to battle all the trainers in here because I find it interesting. Sue me. What's up, Zalo? Yeah, that's right. I, I defeated you. I just wanted to remind you one more time. Alright, past the sobbing Zalo. After I healed, we're going to go into this suspicious cave entrance. It's going to be scary. And I'm not sure if we're going to make it out alive. Yuki, are you ready for this? I will use you as a meat shield if the bullets start flying. I assume there will be bullets, because why wouldn't there be? Alright, let's go. I was emotionally prepared for everything but this. I, uh, what? Shnip, I, I, I don't even, how is, what are, is that, is that a fat bird on your, I don't, why is this head a Pokeball? I, uh, I just can't stop myself from dancing. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God, what do you have to say? Loopa loopa. Loopa. Door! Door, door! Hey, hey, people, going that way is a no-no! Oh, but I can see it! I want it! No, shut up, you bald head! Uh, what do you have to say? Uh, papa! And? Lan papa! That is words of wisdom. Stop! Please! You're not doing it. <laughs> you make it. Yeah, whoa, it's about time, my darlings. I'm so frightfully tired of waiting for you. Stop the music. Thank you. Good, ambiguous speaker. Oh, you kept me waiting for so long. I decided to keep up a little perspiration. Whoa. But my, you have been busy being naughty and messing up our plans. It was oh so close for everything to turn out just right, just the way we hoped. But I can salvage our plan by beating a little man. And so, it's time for one last frantic dance before the grand finale. Let the music play! Epic battle music, please. Oh, God, it's a mental battle. Cypher, Admin, Mirror B. The first real boss fight of the game. He has four Ludicolos. And a Rush Pokemon, as all bosses will. No, I mean, they won't all have four <laughs> Ludicolos. That would be that would be ridiculous. Ludicolos are the evolved form of Lotad. So, all the Lotads you're seeing in there, these things babies. Um, the Ludicolos have different movesets. I, I prefer to have, just a personal reference in LPs, I prefer to have a sense of... What's, what, what's the word I'm looking for? I prefer to have a sense of... 
spont spontaneity when it comes to boss fights, so I did not research their movesets and their abilities. But I do know his general strategy is to make it rain, make it rain, make it rain, make it rain, and to use that to power up the water type attacks on his Ludicolos. Um, so that's why I have man time for this. His Swift Swim does benefit from this fight, so he can go a lot faster, and hopefully Supersonic will, will land. Supersonic is going to be invaluable in this. That's also why I have Noctowl to apply to their flying weakness. This is one of their only weaknesses. I think that is their only weakness. Grass and water? I think so. I could be wrong. Oh, God, that's bad. But it's okay. Oh, whoa. whoa. Also, I have Manton now. He resists a lot of special attacks, and I do not think they have any physical attacks. So, it's going to be good. I think Noctowl, I don't remember. Let me look at his bio. Does he resist special? I don't remember. Noctowl was always something I kind of passed up when I was playing through. Gold and silver. Noctowl, there you are. Uh, yeah, he's got strong special defense, so Noctowl and Mantine will both be great for this. Did Ma Supersonic did hit. Um, I feel like I don't need to use Supersonic again, so I'm going to use Shadow Rush and fly once more on that one. Okay, Shadow Rush! Yeah, here I come! Boom! Oh, this music. I As much as I pretend that I hate it, I actually really love this music. I mean, listen to it. It's just like freaking... Roomba, Amigo de Roomba, what's that Wii game with the brr, 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 brr. it's like the monkey in the sombrero, I made it Alonzo's like symbol for Let's Play, but I didn't actually, haven't done that yet, so I don't know if it's changed or not, or I don't know, it depends on what he wants, oh, they also have Leech Seed, that's spectacular, Leech Seed is an interesting move, you suck health from whatever Pokemon has it every turn, you suck their health out and give it to yourself, now, it can be cured if I pull Mantine out, which I'm strongly tempted to do. In fact, oh, they also have a Rain Dish, and I think they also have Swift Swim. They have Rain Dish and Swift Swim, so that's how they're getting power up from their thing. Um, I'm going to send out Furret, or should I send out Metatite? Metatite doesn't have the greatest special defense, but I think it's better than the Furret. But Espeon also has something pretty good. Uh, I think we go with Espeon. Espeon R go. Now Espeon's Reflect would be better for later on in the fight. But, ah well, we'll just send out Espeon and see what we can do. If he gets seated, we'll send him back. Uh, Razor Leaf, Razor Leaf, no, not the Razor Leaf. Oh, thank God it's not very good. Because um, the power is deducted by 25% when you... Um, blah, blah, blah. The power is deducted by 25% when you have a move that attacks both targets. And because it was technically attacking Noctowl, even though it could not connect because Noctowl was in the air. Oh, look! His next blue to color. Look at that. Um, oh, he's confused. I forgot about that. Oh, ho, 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 ho. he's like, nah, nah, nah. I like, I like to imagine they're like Spanish dancers. Oh, they're so, they're so cute. And he's just like tapping along. Like, Mirror Bee. Like, let me discuss that for a moment. He is a spectacular character. Oh my god, that was a cross shot of Noctowl. That was a little frightening. Um, he is an amazing character. Just, he's so pumped about everything, and the whole character is designed around music, and the afro, and the whole and 80s feel. Oh, it's just so cute. And I, I love characters with afros, because I am an afro. I, I am an afro. Okay, so they also have physical attack with Fury Swipe, but... Was Noctowl standing on the air for a minute? God dang it, Noctowl. Stop making physics not happen. Alright, here we go. Another confusion. Fury Swipes can be bad if it hits Espeon. But hopefully he'll get confused from this confusion. Because it was happening all the time earlier. Nope. But there's Noctowl. He's going to take out. Boom! Oh, critical hits! Woo! I'm on fire! Oh, look at that. Pirouette. Like a Halo character. <laughs> there, he's down. Alright, that's two Ludicolos now. Oh, look at the Ludicolo! Oh boy! <laughs> and like I said earlier, all those low tads we were finding in there, all those low tads and lombres, yep, the love child. This is a sex dungeon. <laughs> Gross. Gross. Oh, rule 34. Ah, get it out of my head. Ew. Grody. Ah, nasty. Uh, yeah, I don't like it. Okay. Um, and then fly once more for that Ludicolo. Because we're. Fly is a good move because it has it, it affects their flying weakness, so that's good. Confuse them, confuse their brains. No, no, no. Down. All right. So now there's just one Ludicolo kind of left, and now we can see his Rush Pokemon. Oh, it kind of dances. 
it kind of just does the in it, in it, in it. Pseudo Wudo. Get the name. It's a pseudo wood. It get it. It means impersonation of wood. I would not want a impersonation of wood. Um. Pfft. Ludicolo, Call of the pros, pros to Ludicolo. Um, starting off, it has the, uh, it's got terrible special defense, so I'm gonna use Swift. Um, it's got the Hardstone, which is an, uh, an item, a held item that increases, that increases rock type moves power. So that's good for him. Um, he's got excellent defenses, and that means he also has the move Flail, which gets more powerful the less HP you have. So, he has such good defenses that a couple of physical attacks, and bam. Now, when I say defense, I mean just his defense. Like, not his special defense. His special defense is abysmal, but we'll get to that later. He's got pretty good attack. That Shadow Rush did a decent amount of damage, considering Noctile wasn't damaged before. That's rather impressive. So, I'm going to throw up a Reflect with Espeon and fly at that Ludicolo. Um, he's got the Rockhead ability, which complements his double edge attack that he'll learn later on. Um, which is a move that's really powerful, a normal type move that's really powerful, but also has a lot of recoil, which means he gets hit after the fact. After he does it, it does some extra damage to him. He ha With the Earthquake TM, it's a good TM because he's got good strong um, uh, attack power. Uh, Shnooba... I think I'm going to risk hitting him with a confusion. Mm, that might have been a mistake. That might have been a mistake. Um, he's really easy to build around the Sandstorm weather effect, which we haven't seen Pokemon that are able to do that yet. But yes, he is easy to build Sandstorm around. Now, I don't want to hit him too much because he's also got the... What am I trying to say here? He's got uh, Shadow Rush, which will do... Oh, wait. No, he doesn't. <laughs> Because he's got the Rockhead ability, which stops... Oh, he might have his other ability. I forgot about that. Uh, cons to Pseudo Wudo. He has special... His special defenses are weak. Just one Surf. One Psychic. Well, not Psychic, obviously. But one Surf. Bam. He's done. Done like a delicious dinner. Mmm. Yummy. Um... His, he has a second ability, Sturdy, which is next to useless. It prevents one-hit KO moves. We haven't encountered a one-hit KO move, but it's a move that has very low PP, which I don't know if I've ever explained this, but PP is that number over there, and we use up a PP every time we use a move. So if I were to use Rock Throw right now, I'd have 14 PP. But uh, one-hit KO moves will kill any Pokemon in one hit. They just have really low accuracy. So the thing about that is... <laughs> freaking... They're super rare, and no one ever uses them because they're impractical, and it's better just to attack it with normal moves. So, Sturdy is a next to useless ability. It has weaknesses that aren't negated. It's it's water and... It's a rock-type Pokemon, even though it looks like it's grass. So it's water and grass um, weaknesses aren't covered by its stats, which is not a good thing to be happening. I don't want to injure him anymore until I figure out if he has Rockhead or Sturdy. So instead, I'm going to use... Well, I mean, Rock Throw will be bad because he'll resist that. Um, I'm going to use an Ultra Ball so I can go ahead and catch him. So that, that, that'll be good. And... Is it's its heart gauge goes down really, really sinking slowly, and it just grows really slowly. And I should know this is one of the Pokemon I was originally intending on using on my team before I decided to go. Oh my God, I caught him! Eat it, Chugga Ha ha You are mine. You are in my computer, and I defeated him. I defeated the Pokeball Head. I can't keep up with the tempo. Oh, well, no, 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 Yum yum! Did you hear those cries? It must be Blussel. I think those cries came from behind that door. Oh, I'm sure they. I don't mind. I want it. <laughs> yes, yes, yes! I'm free. You stay there and just die. 
with your life. All right, we got a TM-49. What is that? I Snatch. We already went over that. Next to useless. Good. Right, Yuki? All right. So we will go in there and help out Plus on the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, you know what you can do? There's an insight coming up. I just want you to look at some of the other videos. You don't have to subscribe unless you really want to. If I mean, if you thoroughly enjoyed this, go ahead. I encourage it. I encourage liking it because that helps. But, you know, more the most valuable thing to me is that you see more of my stuff. Because you might find something else that you like. Because... I do a lot of producing, and it takes a lot of time that I could be dedicating to freaking AP US history. <laughs> yeah, right. I, I won't do that even if I did it free time. All right, I'll see you later. Ooh, screw, 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 screw. Whee! Whee!